He's morally consistent. People get upset, especially establishment. He seems to be saying the same thing. When you actually love working people, you hate the fact that they're being exploited. When you love people of color, you hate white supremacy. If you love women, you hate male supremacy. If you love gay brothers and lesbian sisters, you hate homophobia. If you love trans folk, you hate transphobia. That's what we're talking about. That's what we're talking about. That's what we're talking about. And here's my dear brother, my Jewish brother from the greatest borough in the world, Brooklyn, who makes his connection to Vermont and remains constant with the integrity, honesty, decency, and a concern for the least of these. Echoes really of Hebrew scripture, that hesed, that steadfast love, that loving kindness, that ties, focuses on the orphan, the widow, the fatherless, the motherless, the oppressed, the poor. I don't care where you are, no matter what color, no matter what sexual orientation, no matter what national identity, you are precious, you are priceless, which means that a life in Libya, in Afghanistan, in Pakistan, in Ethiopia, a life in Guatemala, a life in Haiti, a life in Puerto Rico, a life in Tel Aviv, a life in Gaza, a life anywhere on the globe has exactly the same value. Oh, what a great legacy. That's what we're talking about. That's what we're talking about. When you actually love working people, you hate the fact that they're being exploited. When you love people of color, you hate white supremacy. If you love women, you hate male supremacy. If you love gay brothers and lesbian sisters, you hate homophobia. If you love trans folk, you hate transphobia. That's what we're talking about. That's what we're talking about. That's what we're talking about.